and starting with Grammarian that was Lily. Thank you, Madam General Evaluator. For the oh. use of grammar, may I think you have to turn your microphone off. But maybe you've got um, feedback. I'll keep talking and you can see whether it's okay. So the only correction or point that I would say that needed that I would question, Suman, when you said jokes apart, I would say jokes aside. That would be the typical terminology that we use when we're talking, when we're using that expression, jokes aside. The expressions that we used, quite a few interesting expressions, we are social animals. You use the terminology learnings. I think that that is probably a more modern way people are using this terminology. I would have used lessons myself. And I was going to put it in as a correction to say, well, no, that's not quite the right usage. Um, um, listen to my um. Ines then used learnings also, and I do I do believe it is actually a terminology that is quite often used. And the old fashioned way would have been to say lessons instead of learnings. Another expression that I'd like to praise, not meant to deflate someone. That's a very interesting way to say not put somebody down. And scratch the surface is another expression that Tristan has already referred to and is an expression that I'd like to praise. Brian's terminology to envelop you, that when you're using the social media that it just envelops you. And the create instead of consuming from Melissa, I think is a very, very good expression. Digital detox as the final one. And the grammarian's crown, I'd like to give to Melissa for Jomo. That's it from me. Thank you, Lilian, so much. And, and let's hear now.